sir. How going? Good. How much you? Yeah. Adrian Wilson with the 2001 bill. Yeah. You said you wanted me to stop by here and you want to take a look at the car. You still want to do that? I did. Yeah. Let me see what you said happened to us. Again, we didn't do anything to the car. I promise you we didn't do anything to the car. down because we don't want to lock keys in cars we never lock keys in cars it's just not what we do we roll windows down that's why the window got stuck down and we had to eric in there had to grab it like this when i went to test drive it i did the the switch and worked it up okay no no let me finish please i'll let you talk okay so we didn't do that now it was here for a little time it was in our back lot every once in a while we see cars that have been gone through in our back lot. Somebody could have done something. I don't know. I, I'm, I'm, I'm completely unaware of it. It's not. I wasn't that familiar with your car to know what had and had not. I didn't notice anything unusual with it. So if it happened here, it wasn't us. It was in the back lot of the car. Or, you know, it happened in the back lot. It had to. Because we don't do anything to, to do what you're claiming we did. We didn't do it. I mean, I'll, we didn't do it. So, but go ahead. You you explain what you're saying. Why would they get into a car that's in a transmission shop? Dude, I, I don't know. No every rare in once, it. every rare once in a while, we come in. We see doors open, glove boxes open, stuff like that. People, they're always looking for something. We don't leave anything in the back lot that has anything in it that has any value, and we generally leave the doors unlocked so that you know. They don't break a window. Because back years past, they break a window. So we will leave a door unlocked now. So when they break a window, who's responsible for that? I guess your insurance. I mean, we have insurance as well, but when you leave a car with us, you have to sign off that you're ultimately responsible for it. Okay? If you want my insurance information, I'll be happy to give it to you. If you want to file a claim, I'm not denying any of that. But my stance we didn't do that and i want you to understand we didn't do that if it happened here it happened in my back lot so you where i'm locked complete. the key in the car and break we, into it you didn't you didn't do that no. y'all didn't do that we've been in business long enough to know not to leave that's that's why i knew about the window all right and you can ask the gentleman in here when i went to back it out and drive so, it okay. the, it was a cold day why or rain somebody, one of the two. why was somebody try to force the one down when they can just break the damn one. What do you mean force it down? I used to be a car thief. Okay, what what do you mean force it down? I'm not following what that's why the window regulator was damaged. It was forced down. That's why this was bent. Again, okay. why would somebody take the time to pull this out when they can just break the window? Why would a car thief do that? Again. We didn't do it. I'll put my hand on a Bible. Dude, we've been in this business a long time. Somebody said he put the hand on the Bible. I, it's a complete no, no, waste of time. No, no, no. But I pride myself to be completely honest. So this is a waste of time. I'll give you my insurance information. I promise. You, if you get something from them, that's fine. But personally, we did not do that. And we don't take responsibility for your car. If it's left here, and, and you left it here for more than a normal amount of time because you were, you'd left it here and then you were deciding whether or not to have the work done. You did call me. Yes, I did. You said that I gave you the wrong number. 
Okay. Remember that? Okay. No, well, I did with a lot of people. But I thought it was Look at. Okay. I, you told me you was gonna call me Tuesday. You didn't call, me, but you said, "Oh, you had the wrong number." Okay. Well, it's still sat here for more time than a normal car sits here. So. I told you to go ahead. Okay, but I still like to talk to people before we do. We like to verify what we're doing to a vehicle before we start sir, just willing to learn. Beautiful. 